present you are the future of our country so on this day i wish you joy and success in whatever you do happy children's day hi kids you are so special to us wishing you a very enjoyable day happy children's day to all my dear budding stars Today November fourteen. It's a day for you. Yes, Children's Day. I wish you all, my little ones, to shine in the sky like stars in your life. We teachers are here. Join our hands to you to achieve your dreams in future. It will make us proud. Children, make your parents and your nation proud. i pray god to shower his blessing and lot of wisdom on you my heartful love to all of you dear children happy children's day thank you good morning children on this day of children's day i would like to tell you how childhood should be considered childhood is an enchanting vista it is an endless fun a joyful classroom an experience and above all an era of imagination may your childhood be blossomed with lots of flavors and colors spreading happiness all around and that's my wish for you all on this special day tulli thirinda kaalangal please uh, how are you all uh, really i am feeling very happy to meet you all uh, through this video uh, really students i am missing you all and our school anyhow with god's grace uh, i have got a chance to send my wishes uh, to this small video uh, so i wish you all a very happy children's day hope we will be meeting very soon thank you time for some splashing fun cheers and jolly time for everyone because it's children's day may the love and laughter always stay on every child's face happy children's day every child is a different kind of flower and all together makes this world a beautiful garden hey my dear kids i wish everybody on this auspicious day may god gives lot of blessings throughout this year happy children's day Good morning. I am Ashya studying in grade six. Today I am going to talk about everybody should learn to play a team sport. A team sport is an activity in which a group of individuals on the same team work together to accomplish an ultimate goal, which is usually to win. Some team sports are practiced between opposing teams, where the players interact directly between them to achieve an objective. Keeping a team motivated is hard and unexpected effort. Understanding is very important in team sport. And thank you. Hi, my name is Tegana and I'm studying grade six. Today I am here to speak on the topic. Everyone should learn to play a team sport. There is no doubt that sports are as important as education. This is. while it is argued that it is necessary to learn team sport for children during their educational education period hey everybody i am abila select from grade 7a i am here to let everyone know that team sport is very very important for every single individual to know sports which are played in teams play a vital role in the overall development of the children these sports activities are essential for the child's personality development as they learn teamwork and coordination 
Thank you everybody and have a very good day. I am Ashley and I am studying in grade 8. Today I am going to say something about the topic everybody should learn to play peaceful. Sports are as important as education to build an individual. It is necessary to learn team sports for children during their education period. Team sports should be an essential part of an education curriculum. Because in this way children will learn how to apply themselves in a team. For example, if a child will learn how to perform a team through sports, will be grown up in a better team member on a field in future. Thus, it is recommended for students to learn group sports. Thank you. Good morning to all. This is Vibiblin Joshvi from Grade 6A, the school from Mount Litra Z School name. I am going to say the topic everybody should learn to play at team sport. Playing team sport helps develop teamwork and leadership skills. Working as a team to reach a common helps children develop teamwork, communication and problem solving skills. That will benefit them on the field and off. The sports help teach dedication, leadership and other skills. Thank you. Good morning. My name is Daniel Dijo and I am from class 7. Today I would like to speak about why we should play team sport. Teamwork is one of the basic needs for an organization to achieve all its goals. One of the most significant advantages of working in a team is that the work gets divided between all the group members. When the work is shared between all the members, get equal amount of work and a single person does not need to do a lot of the work. In a team, every person has a different work assigned. If put together, it will help them achieve their goals. All the members should understand each other and learn their weaknesses and areas in which they excel and work according to that. They should learn to cooperate and work with each other. Teamwork is necessary for the smooth functioning of the group. Everyone has to contribute towards working in a team so that they can achieve their goals. We have to learn to work in a team so that we can achieve our goals easily. Hence, I would like to conclude by saying that everyone should learn to play a team sport. Thank you. A person, good morning to everyone. My name is Tanisha from grade 8. I am going to give an elocution about the topic everyone should learn to play team sport. Team sport is an activity in which group of individuals play in a uh, play in group uh, play together to accomplish a goal usually to win. This team sport improve our skills and confident. This confident is uh, very important in our future lives. In future, if there is any challenges, this confidence will help us to overcome the future challenges very easily. Thank you. Ha happy Children's Day. A warm welcome to all my teachers and schoolmates and Fiona of Grade 6. Extend a warm greetings to you all in this excited and vibrant section. I will speak about everybody should plan to play a team sport. Talent wins games, but teamwork and intelligence wins championships. Sports are good for our body and spirit. It encourages and gives us more confidence. Working in team also gives us more open and train our social skills and group work. Children should play team sport because the children who are playing in team uh, activities, they are most likely to be in best in schools, have better concentration and self-confidence. So everybody learn to play team sport. Thank you. I am Ant and I am studying in grade 9. Today I am going to talk about how Indian scientists have built India to grow. When it comes to Indian scientists, the first name comes to my mind is C.V. Raman. C.V. Raman was the first Indian to win the Nobel Prize. His work was related to the light and sun. APJ Abdul Kalam is the second name that comes in my mind to Indian scientists. APJ Abdul Kalam worked as an aerospace engineer at ISRO and ERBO. He was also president of India from 2002 to 2007. 
everyone should not only invest that much as possible in science and technology but also should stay aware of all new technologies developed around the world thank you good day everybody my name is anisha alex of thank you and i am here to speak on the topic how indian scientists have helped india grow so basically what is science science is an important part of our everyday life cv raman homi j baba venkat raman radhakrishnan and many more scientists who have changed the world now i have a few contributions by the indian scientists to india several scientific developments new techniques promising technologies in the field ranging from nanotechnology to space weather well i have a few contributions made by the indian scientists the important developments reported by the indian scientists during the year firstly a gel that could protect the farmers from toxic pesticides secondly faster diagnostic test for tuberculosis infection scientists have jointly developed highly sensitive and rapid tests for tuberculosis for the detection of tuberculosis infection in the lungs and surrounding members thirdly world's thinnest material with novel techniques and many more thus one should be proud of our indian scientists or of our country and their great talent thank you everybody and have a very good day good morning my name is devi and i'm studying in class 9 today i'm going to talk about how indian scientists have helped india grow Scientists have helped a lot in the development of India. Scientists have contributed to all the sectors. Scientists are also helping to cure diseases and save lives. Medical science has evolved so much and saved billions of lives. New technologies like wireless brain sensors, artificial organs, uh, smart inhalers, robotic surgery and virtual reality are making work easier for thousands of doctors around the world and these new technologies are also saving lives and curing diseases we should encourage scientists who have helped india grow thank you good afternoon i i am ansika christopher of grade 5 I am going to sing Vande Mataram song. Vande Mataram, Sujalam Sufulam, Malayaj Shitalam, Shashya Shamalam Mataram, Sujalam Sufulam, Malayaj Shitalam, Shashya Shamalam Mataram. Vande Mataram. And I am studying Grade Four. Now I am going to sing the poem Little by Little, Little by Little, and a concert. As it slowly sang the mossy bird, I am eating every day. Little by little, the leaf appears, and the slender branch spread. Far, far and wide, the till the mighty wolf is and far is bright. Thank you. I'm Asha Hani from Grade Four. Shanti nila vendum, engum shanti nila vendum. Ah, ma shakti vonga vendum. Hi, my name is Nifna. I am from Grade Four. Today, I am here to recite my favorite poem, "Raining the Night." Raining, raining all night long. Sometimes loud, sometimes dark. Soft, just like a song. There will be rivers in the meadows and lakes along with the streets. Hey, my dear teachers and friends, my name is Fiona Sharon. I am in Grade Five. Today, I am going to sing a song called "Heal the World" by Michael Jackson. 
There's a place in your heart And I know that it is love And this place could much brighter than tomorrow And if you really try You find there's no need to cry In this place you feel there's no hurt or sorrow There are ways to get there If you care enough for the living Make a little space Hi everybody, I, I am Diyaji of grade 3. I am going to sing my favorite Malayalam song. Mm Let no one 
not. Hi everyone, my name is Padmadina. I am studying grade 3. Today I am going to talk about my favorite one. Raindrops on roofs and pixels on teachers. Bright copper kettles and warm woolen mittens. Brown paper packages tied up with strings. Then melt into springs. These are a few of my favorite things. When the dog bites, when the bee stings, when I'm feeling sad, I still remember my favorite things. Thank you. I am Mishka BGB, grade 5, Mom and School, my Lord. In the present, I will be able to and I am studying in grade 5. Today I am going to sing a song called By the Rivers of Babylon by Boni Yang. By the rivers of Babylon they are we sat down everywhere when we remember Zion they had the wind carried us away in captivity required from us a song now how shall we sing the Lord's song in a strange land? Good morning to all. My name is Siva Krishna, grade 4. From Mount Etrasi School, Mayor. I, I, I am going to recite the poem Sea Song. I found a shirt, a curly one, so lying on the sand. I pick it up and took it home and hold it inside my hand. Mommy looked at it and then she held it to my ear. I came from the shelf there came the sun, soft and sweet and clear. I was surprised, I listened her, but it was really true. I wish you could find a, find it near a nice big shell and hear it singing too. Hi everyone, I am Jogan. Now I am singing a song. Little police officer works in Kitchener. 
My name is Anvinya Rachel and I am studying in first grade. Today I am going to talk about Sonic the Hedgehog. And Sonic is super duper fast. His enemy is Eggman and he's trying Eggman is trying to get Sonic's power and Eggman is trying to do lots of robot but it didn't work. My name is Santan Daikal. I am a student of grade 1A. Today, I am going to speak about my favorite cartoon character and why I love lots of cartoon characters like Chota Bean, Ninja Hattori, Putra, Mighty Raju and etc. But my top most favorite cartoon character is Putra. My name is Bona. I am studying way to eat Maurita Beachful My Lord. Do you love tunes? Yes! I love the full of cartoon. Now, I'm going to tell you about my favorite cartoon character. Sheepa! He means any cartoon character. Nandu. Tanu. Tanu gets me. Favorite cartoon character? Okay. Sing the song. When you run a very thick. Ditora. Ditora. Good morning everybody. My name is Eileen Shreya. I am studying Redon. Today I am going to tell about my favorite cartoon character is Dora. Do you know who is Dora? Dora is a 7 years old girl. She is very clever and smart. Hi everyone. My name is Kaushika Skurichandran. Studying grade 2. My favorite cartoon character is Peppa. It's a funny character. Peppa lives with her mommy a pig daddy pig and little brother George. My name is Asya. <coughs> I'm studying grade 2. Today I'm going to speak about my favorite cartoon character. My favorite cartoon character is Dora. Dora is a very helpful person. She helps her friends on the show. Others, how we should help others, 
by watching this cartoon. My name is Pippin John. I am studying grade 2. Today I am going to talk about something very interesting, something from fun. Yes, cartoon. So we all love cartoon. My favorite cartoon character is Mickey Mouse. Hello. I am from Lady Toofy. I am going to sing a speech about my favorite cartoon. My favorite cartoon is Chin Chan. He is a five years old boy. He lives in Japan. He has many friends. His main friends are Kasama, Masao, Nene and Bochan. I love you. My name is Yves Kieri from grade 2. My favorite cartoon is Doraemon. Dan and Tree, Gandhi Tata, Cookies, 